boys and girls welcome to present truth for kids my name is auntie tamara no i was given to the task to share with you about our jamaican banana plant here is a lot of jamaican banana plant right in our backyard now before we begin let us kneel for prayer our heavenly father as we bow in your presence we give you thanks for your love and your tender mercies and i ask you now dear father to take full control and to lead out in this small presentation where i will, will be sharing with our boys and girls about the tropical plant the banana plant that you have blessed jamaica with i ask of you to to Help me to speak with clarity so that they can understand and help that it will be a blessing and help them to share what they have learned from the banana plant which is here in Jamaica. I ask you now, Father, to lead and to direct according to your will and your way. In Jesus' name, amen. No. The banana plant is a herbaceous plant with pseudo stems wrapped together to form a trunk like structure. It blooms within a year of planting, producing fruit within two to three months of flowering. Bananas are tropical plants, susceptible to cold temperatures there are many different varieties of which are inedible no what do i mean by herbaceous when you look at the definition for herbaceous it means a herb and when you look at the definition of a herb it means a medicine so the banana plant is used for a medicine and in Revelation 22 God says that he has given us the leaves of the nation as a herb of healing it is of healing so this plant here is a herb plant now what do I mean by pseudostem the pseudostem is a part of a banana plant that looks like a trunk so here, the pseudostem, it looks like a trunk. So this is the pseudostem. And as we go on in our, in our video, we will look at the components and the different things of the pseudostem. Now, what do I mean by inedible? It means that it is not safe to eat. So we have many different varieties of banana which are not eatable it cannot be eaten so we have to know the ones that can be eaten and the ones that cannot be eaten right so what do i mean by successful it means that the banana cannot strive in a cold temperature right so you have the foreign countries that there's it snows so it cannot strive there just like you have many different plant or fruits that is in other cold countries that cannot strive in Jamaica because Jamaica is a tropical country. So this type of banana plant cannot strive in a cold country. Now the different structure of the banana plants are we have the midrib, we have the leaves, we have the inflorescent or the cluster the flower cl cluster and then we have the pseudo stem which i have mentioned previously and then we have the leaf sheath the corm and the root so let us identify these things on the banana plant right so let us identify the structures so we have the midrib all right i'll use this one the midrib is this piece that is inside it's like a bone thing there here hope you can see it is this hard part here that is in the middle and then we have the leaves see the leaves on the banana plant so these are the leaves and the middle part here is like the almost like the spinal cord this is the midrib and the leaves now the inflorescent or the flower cluster is this thing here want you all to see what I'm talking this thing here is the inflorescent 
and then the pseudo stem as i've mentioned previously is this trunk like structure so this structure and then we have the sheath the leaf sheath sorry then we have the leaf sheath the leaf sheaths are these things here and it is wrapped around to form this structure so these are the leaf sheaths these things that are here they are the leaf sheaths this is the leaf sheaths here and then you have it all wrapped around all wrapped around the banana plant to form its structure and then we have the corm the corm is this part down here right here the corm is here and then the root is beneath here so boys and girls for today as we have looked at the structure the different structure of the banana plant the midrib the leaf the inflorescent the pseudostem the leaf sheath the corm and the root and we looked at it too that the banana plant is a herbal plant it is used as a medicine right and we look at that it, is, it blooms within a year of planting and it produces fruit within two to three months of flowering and we look also at that it is a tropical plant and it, it cannot survive in a cold temperature no boys and girls in our next video we will be looking at each details of the structure of our plants and then we are going to look at the medicinal purposes of that plant that god has blessed us with right so boys and girls before we close off let us kneel for prayer oh heavenly father as we bow in your presence we give you thanks for this opportunity where we could come before your presence and even myself sharing with the boys and girls about our our jamaican tropical plant the banana plant and looking at the structures of it and how it blooms and how it does it survive whether in a cold or a tropical area and etc and as we see to continue this video i ask you dear father in a special way to help their minds so that they can understand and learn something from jamaica lead and direct according to your will and your way in christ's name amen Bye, boys.